Welcome back. We're going to do a cardio circuit today. You don't need any equipment. I'm going to show you a couple modifications that you can make just to make sure that this is right for any activity level. Uh, let me get my timer started and we'll get going. All right, timer's going. We're going to start with a split jump. If you need a regressed version of this, just do a split squat. You can even use the wall to help you Three, with balance. You don't even two, have to go all the way down. One, if you feel go. up to it, though, you can join me in the split jump. So we're going to go 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. This is not about max height on these jumps. It's about really good technique. So once I land, I want to find my heel contact in the ground. Big thing is don't jump with the back. You want to jump with the hips. I'm realizing I'm taking a break to explain things. So if this is tough for you, just slow Three, down. Two, Something like this. One, stop. Something like that where you're taking some breaks. Second one, we're gonna go to the ground. This is the Turkish get up. We're gonna start with the right arm here. I'm laying on my Three, back. Two, one. Go. Reach with the arm, turn the shoulders, then come up to the elbow, then to the hand, then bridge. Then, if this is totally new to you, this is probably too much. So just go back down. If you know how to do them though, you can do the whole rep. You're gonna bring your knee back, come up into half kneeling, and then stand like a lunge, and then we come back. Just make sure you keep your eyes on the straight arm the whole time. And if you've done these before, you can even hold some weight. You don't want it to be too heavy though. Three, two, one, stop. Nice. And for the next one, we're gonna switch sides. You can only get a couple reps, so I don't like doing uh, alternating sides on that one. Three, two, one. Arm go. is long, elbow, hand, bridge, kneel, up, squat, lunge, and back down. Same idea here. Keep your eyes up on the weight with a straight hand. I'm gonna pick up the pace a little. This is way easier than the split jump. Three, two, one, stop. And that's round number three. Round number four is the wall march. So we're doing 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest. On this one, just try to keep moving. Three, um, you wanna think about two, keeping the straight one, leg really go. straight. So you're squeezing the butt on each rep and you're trying to bend the bent knee up as high as you can. You wanna, one thing you can kind of think about on this one is separating your hips, your feet, your knees. You want one to come as straight down and back as you can, and the other one bends up as high as it can. <clears throat> when we look at this one, it's easy to think about the bending leg, but it's actually more important to really hammer the straight leg. Get a good glute squeeze. Three, two, one, stop. Show off your buns for the bystanders. Next one is a Spider-Man push-up. So there's a couple ways to do this one. The advanced version is to keep your foot off the ground. Three, if that's too tough, two, one, you can go. bring your foot up, leave it down, and then do a push-up from there, and then switch sides. Same thing, so my foot is on the ground. If that's too hard, just do this. Just like a plank with an alternating position. But if you need the hard version, keep your foot off the air. Just make sure when you get to the top, you push your arms long and you're not shrugging them, right? We don't want you to have a headache when you're done. Want the arms nice and long. And 
three, two, one, stop. Nice. That's five. Five of six. Last one is a front plank, which I think is going to be hard after the push-ups. But I just did two, some testing and one, go. I need to be better at front planks, so we're doing them. On this one, just try to be as relaxed as you can for your breathing. Big thing is back position. You don't want your butt falling down toward the ground. That's gonna overload the back. You wanna stay up with the ab muscles. Three, two, one, stop. Ooh, one round down. I gotta thank you for being here because I definitely would have stopped early on that plank if you weren't watching. Next one, we're coming back, starting over, split jumps. Three, two, one. Remember, just do the split squat. Go. If this one's catching up to you, or if it doesn't feel very good, and remember, it's not about max height. You can't jump for max height for 45 seconds. I'm actually gonna take little breaks in the middle of the set and just try to keep moving. As much as I can. I don't wanna push myself to total fatigue because then this isn't cardio. <laughs> this is high intensity interval training. Three, two, one, stop. Good, okay. That felt about right for me. Back to the ground. We got the Turkish get up. Three, two, one, go. Remember, make sure to turn. This isn't a sit up. You want a good rotation on these. Try to breathe through your nose as best Three, you can. Two, one, stop. It's just a lot more restful when you breathe through your nose. Your airways dilate a little more. You're less likely to get exercise-induced asthma. <clears throat> it's easy for me Three, to forget about that. Two, one, Especially when I'm go. on camera talking through my mouth, not my nose. Now for the left arm up, it's actually pretty common to feel limited in the neck position. It's hard to turn the head to the left. The base of the neck, just with the natural asymmetry in the body, the base of the neck is already rotated to the left. So it doesn't like to go any further. So you gotta kinda Push it a little bit to position Three, two, the thorax, one, stop. the rib cage. Next one is wall march. We're standing back up. This one, if you don't have a wall, you can just march in place as well. Three. Or if two, the wall is super inconvenient one, to use. Go. Remember, worry about that straight leg though.
three, two, one, stop. Nice. All right, feeling good. Spider-Man push-up. I got the uh, hockey player hike going on here. These shorts, they get stuck. Three, two, one, go. Remember, you can keep your foot on the ground in an effort to get reps the whole time. If you need to take a break, not a big deal. Feel free to. Just do your best. Try to keep moving as much as you can during the 45 second periods. I'd rather, oh man, I'd rather be easy and you keep moving. Three, two, one, stop. I'm glad I kept my foot down on that. That's gotten quite difficult. I'd rather you make it easier and keep moving. So if the push-up part is hard, just do the alternating Three, plank with the foot height. Two, thing. one. Front go. plank. Last one of round two. Yeah, this is brutal to do after the push-up. <laughs> what were you thinking? <sighs> They're just dying. I'm trying to keep the mid back pulled up towards the ceiling with Three, the abs. Two, one, stop. That keeps the. Kind of helps if you have winging shoulder blades. You get this little reach. I am just dripping. You get this little reach in the shoulder blade that flushes it with Three, the rib cage. Two, one. So they don't wing go. off the rib cage. Back to split jumps. Ooh. Lost my balance. That's how I know I'm tired. a good one. And by good I mean hard. Three, two, one, go. So I know Turkish get-ups are too technically complex to really listen to me, but I'm gonna talk to you anyway. On these, a cardio circuit like this with an interval of 45 seconds of work and 15 seconds of rest. The idea is to make this an active recovery day. So I'm getting my heart rate going, warming up my body, warming up my tissues. So I kind of work out any sorts of soreness that might Three, be in my body. Two, one, stop. And I keep the flow of stuff coming, not just through the blood, but through the tissues. You get these, three, you know, two, uh, one, go. Immune byproducts that are in there that you might want to clear out to help you put on more muscle, lose more weight, you know, whatever your goal is. Even strength, like cardio even works for strength. Just helps that recovery so much. And I'm saying all this because I think some of these exercises are misleading because they're hard to do for the whole 45 seconds. But that's not the goal. The goal is, hey, here's something that you can do 
during this minute. Three, two, one, stop. And it's up to you to do the appropriate amount of it. It's not about max output, like how many reps can I get? It's just about staying Three, moving. Two, one. Back to the wall march. Remember, squeeze that straight leg. Three, two, one, stop. Nice. Spider Man push up back to the ground. Remember, don't burn out too much. This isn't Three, your only workout of two, the week, right? One, go. Hey, if it is, that's fine. Whatever you gotta do to keep moving. Three, two, one, stop. Okay, push up down. Almost done with the third round. Planks are next. Stay down there, good luck. Three. If you want to do it from your knees, that's fine. One, go. Now, as fatigue ramps up here, you want to make sure you keep focusing on that nasal breathing. Remember, it's more restful. It's going to help keep this a recovery workout <clears throat> rather than a stimulation workout that will require recovery. Try not to let Three, shoulders side two, towards one, the ground. Stop. Whew. Push to the elbows the whole time. That's three down. Two to go. Right? Two to go? Yeah, that's the math. Oh my god. It's so salty. The air is Three, so salty. Two, Split jump. One. Go. Whew. I feel like I'm gonna slip on this mat. <sighs> I'm just gonna do some lunges now, just so I can keep moving. I feel like I'm having to jump with my knee a lot because my muscles are so tired. Three, two, so one, stop. Some lunges are a little more appropriate towards the end of those sets for me. All right, Turkish get up. I imagine you're looking forward to this one because this Three, is obviously two, the easiest one. One, go. <laughs> At least for me. Remember, make sure that arm stays long and you get a nice shoulder rotation. It's not a sit up, right? It's a get up, it's a different exercise. And I actually don't like sit ups, so I really don't want you to do the other exercise. 
they just compress your spine too much. Three, two, this rotation one, feels stop. a lot better. Works with the positions of the body a lot better. And uh, you get good timing of the deep abdominal muscles, Three, which stabilizes your back. Two, one. This one, when, so that I get up here, when it's done wrong, it can be pretty tough on someone's back. But when you do it right, it's actually pretty good. Just got to make sure you get that twist through the shoulders. Load the hips. Yeah. Three, two, one, stop. All right. Back to the wall march. Whew. Three, two, one, go. I'm going to squeeze that straight leg. Three, two, one, stop. Nice. That wall march is really good for, you know, if you have nagging back stuff or knee stuff, it's good for ironing out asymmetries. Three, two, Ooh, okay. one, go. Push up. Spider Man push up line. <laughs> Literally dripping. <laughs> Three, two, one, stop. Ooh. The hard part about these is when you're drenched by the end of this, your hands just keep slipping. Sliding. Three, two, one. All right, plank. Go. This is my least favorite. <laughs> That's why we're doing it though, because I need it. And so do you probably. Three, two, one, stop. Okay. All right. Four down? Yeah, four down. One to go. Yeah. Three, I'm you, it's two, here. one, go. Split jump, last time. Doing good, last round.
three, two, one, stop. Oh man. Back to the ground for the Turkish get up. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, stop. Ooh, my quads feel that. Feel that real well. You guys, it's a good thing I got my three glasses two, strap on here. One, go. I would, I would definitely have lost them had I not put my uber nerdy croaky on. <laughs> Three, two, one, stop. Whoo, okay. Three more. Halfway through the last round. Got those wall marches again. Remember to try to cue that button. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, stop. Good deal. Good deal. Back to the ground, Spider-Man push-up. We got it. Positive outlook. Three. Things are two, going well. One. Go. I feel strong. <laughs> oh my god, I'm slipping. <laughs> Uh. Three, two, one, stop. Oh man, that is so tough. Alrighty, last one, front plank, we got it. Last one, last one. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> So we've been doing great. Nice job. When we're all done with this, that's 30 minutes of exercise. We didn't even need to warm up. The warm up is the workout. Hopefully you feel looser. Hopefully you got your cardio in. Hopefully you're better prepared for your next workout. Hope you liked it. If you learned something, hit the like button and subscribe to be notified 
when Three, I release new videos. Two, <sighs> one. Ooh. If you need something else to watch, I mean, I got a whole playlist of uh, me coaching exercises. You might like some of that stuff. Maybe, you know, you want to clean up your form on something. Give that a shot.